SNES Chronicles, reviewing all the games on the Super Nintendo by release date. Home Alone. And they start you right off with the credits. They seem so proud. This game came out December 31st, 1991. So they missed the mark, I think. Should have come out a little before Christmas. Would have made more sense. I guess they were late since the movie just came out. Uh, nope, the movie came out in October 1990. Wow, you really missed the mark on that one. A year late and after Christmas. Oof. Unfortunately, I'm sure they still sold a ton. I say unfortunately because, well, let's find out. Sounds are extremely basic. Kind of the stock sound you would find on a sound effects compilation disc. And the music is extremely boring. A couple of Christmas songs. And not even those you hear in the movie. I'm sure they took these songs because they didn't have to pay rights for them. The graphics are passable, I guess. They're colorful. Animations are a strict minimum. And I have to talk about the characters. They really could have done a better job. I guess a blonde boy is enough for Kevin. But what's up with some of these burglars? They did a pretty good job on Marv. At least in the cutscenes, it's movie clips. Cutscenes. I am trying to find some positive aspects here. At first, the gameplay feels like your typical platformer. Collect the things and move on. A lot of games like this, but this one feels so boring and repetitive. All the levels are the same. Collect. Dump. Enter basement. Kill boss. Rinse. And repeat. Very basic. You collect pizza to get lives. You can also collect weapons. But they never really feel effective at all. Wait for it. Jeez. One cool thing is you can use the traps to get the burglars. But again, they could have done a so much better job than this. More variety, I don't know. At first I had a lot of difficulty. The controls are very slippery. And some of these patterns are just weird. But once you get the hang of it, it's rather easy. Levels are very long and not in a good way. Lots of running back and forth since your bag gets full and you have to dump some stuff in the basement all the time. At least there's only four levels. I guess that's a positive aspect. Yeah, in case you didn't figure it out, I really didn't like this. A very bad game. But if we compare it to other movie-based games, it's okay. I've seen much, much worse. Doesn't mean you should play it. See you soon. And remember, have fun. Peace. If you appreciate, please like and subscribe. There's also a Facebook page, and every episode is available in French.